The right to adequate housing and shelter is recognized in the Universal Declaration of Human Rights and in the Constitution of many countries, including Brazil. Research shows that the housing deficit in Brazil affects 6.2 million people, approximately 8.8% of the country's population. In recent decades, social movements fighting for the universal right to housing have been occupying abandoned buildings as a means to push for a change in this landscape. These places usually belong to bankrupt businesses or public agencies with tax debts or irregular documentation. They are the so-called occupações, each one with their own internal structure and regiment. We are inside an occupied building in Sao Paulo, Brazil's biggest city. Thirteen families are living here, including children, elderly, and people with illnesses. This four-story building used to be a private school, but it's been vacant for eight years. Each room works as a separate dwelling. Bathrooms are shared. The furniture and appliances come from previous occupations and the families try to make the most of the local setting. It's a temporary dwelling. It will last until the owner goes to court to get its inhabitants removed. <laughs> 